Welcome back to the Travelling Bear with Stu Bear and especially our aviation enthusiasts. Today we're taking a journey back in time to explore one of the most iconic aircraft of World War II, the Mosquito. Join us as we delve into the fascinating history and remarkable features of this legendary wooden wonder. But before we take flight, make sure you hit the subscribe button and buckle up for an adventure through the skies. The de Havilland Mosquito, often referred to as the Wooden Wonder, was a revolutionary aircraft that defied convention. Let's uncover the story behind this incredible machine that played a crucial role in the history of aviation. Crafted mainly from wood, the Mosquito's design was a departure from traditional all-metal aircraft. This not only made it lighter, but also incredibly fast and versatile. The Mosquito wasn't just a pretty face, it proved its metal in various roles, from bomber to a reconnaissance aircraft and even a night fighter. Its adaptability and speed made it a formidable force in the skies. Speaking of speed, the Mosquito was one of the fastest aircraft of its time. With its twin engine setup and sleek design, it could outrun many contemporary fighters. Its maneuverability made it a favourite among pilots. The Mosquito played a crucial role in several historic operations, including precision bombing raids and photo reconnaissance missions. It was a silent and deadly force that left its mark on aviation history. The legacy of the Mosquito lives on. Its design influenced future aircraft and its impact on military aviation is undeniable. Today, we can still marvel at the beauty and ingenuity of this wooden wonder. The de Havilland Mosquito was a remarkable aircraft with unique specifications. Keep in mind that different variants of the Mosquito had variations in specification, but here's the general specification for the Mosquito. The general specification for the Mosquito is that a pilot, navigator, slash bombardier. It's got a length of 44 feet 6 inches, a wingspan of 54 feet 2 inches, and a height of 17 feet 5 inches, with a power plant of two Rolls Royce Merlin 21 or 23 liquid cooled V12 engines. And the performance, it had a maximum speed of 384 miles an hour, a range approximately 1,500 miles, and a service ceiling of 37,000 feet, with a rate of climb of 2,300 feet per minute. Various guns depending on the mission, but typically four 303 Browning machine guns in the nose and four 20mm Hispano cannons in the wing. It could also carry bombs of various loads, including up to 4,000 pounds. As we mentioned earlier, the Mosquito was primarily constructed of wood, utilizing plywood, monocoque, fuselage, and wooden wing structures. This design contributed to its speed and agility. The nose section housed the pilot and navigator in a side-by-side -side configuration. There you have it. The de Havilland Mosquito, a true marvel of aviation engineering. If you've enjoyed this journey through history, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe for more of our great adventures. Not just aviation, but of course, all our motorhome travels. And this particular video at the beginning, it was actually filmed at one of the Britstop stayover sites. So hey, stay tuned for more information.